This conference will now be recorded. We're ready to go. Good evening, everyone. Uh, welcome to the regular meeting of Mayor and Council of the Borough of Glassboro for June 23rd, 2020. I'd like to call it to order. Karen, please read the opening statement. Pursuant to the Open Public Meetings Act, I hereby announce that adequate notice of this meeting, as required by said act, has been provided by adopting a schedule of regular meetings for the year 2020, which schedule was posted on the Borough Hall Bulletin Board, as well as the Borough website, and forwarded to both the South Jersey Times and the Sentinel of Gloucester County and filed with the Borough Clerk on January 4th, 2020. Thank you. Can we all rise and salute the flag, please? I Thank you. Karen, could you please have roll call? Mayor Wallace. Here. Mr. Casabone. Present. Mr. D'Alessandro? Yeah, here. Mr. Fiola? Here. Mr. Halter? Yes. Ms. Miller? Here. Mrs. Spence? Here. Mr. Melandro? Here. Mr. Scafidi? Present. Mr. Brunimer? Here. Thank you. Uh, we have no pro uh, proclamations or presentations, so at this time I'll turn the meeting over to our borough solicitor. Thank you, Mayor. We have a number of ordinances this evening on public hearing. First being ordinance number 20-14, that being ordinance authorizing execution of second amendment to purchase and sale agreement with Glassboro Real Estate Trust LLC. If council moves for the public portion uh, with regard to this ordinance, uh, council members Alessandro and Spence will abstain from action. I'll move the public portion be open. Second. Okay, I have a motion by Council President Costabone, a second by, I believe, Councilman Halter. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? And motion carries. Uh, all the, um, anyone from the public that wishes to, uh, Make comment on this proposed ordinance, please do so at this time. I guess it's okay to say hearing none, I move the poly portion be closed and the ordinance adopted as written. Second. Okay, I have a motion by Council President Casabone, seconded by Councilman Fiola. Uh, Karen, roll call, please. Mr. Casabone. Yes. Mr. D'Alessandro. Abstention. Mr. Fiola. Four. Mr. Halter. Four. Ms. Miller. Four. Mrs. Spence. Abstain. Oh, that motion carries. There we have ordinance number 20-15 and ordinance amending chapter 27, court municipal section five, amendments for fines payable to the code of the borough of Glassboro. Council moves for the public portion. This was pulled from the agenda. Yeah. Uh, oh no, uh, so this is a new one, Karen, not the one we first started out with. I'm sorry, I missed, I may have missed that. I'm sorry, this is the one I was, um, I was um, under the impression that per your, uh, your associate's email today, this was being pulled from the agenda. I think this is, uh, well, um, wouldn't be up for a public hearing because this is the one that uh, Dawn was asking us to look into. I'm, I'm looking at my agenda. Let me see what we have, ordinance 20, because we would not have the ordinance. <laughs> this was the increase of court fees. Yes, so we had, so there's a two part answer as usual. Dawn had sent around initially the list to increase uh, by a dollar. If that's this one, yes. then, we would, then we need to adopt this one. She was looking to add 
additional ones, uh, but has changed your mind. So we would certainly act on this ordinance tonight, yes. I apologize, my mistake. Nope, nope, it, it was confusing to agree. <laughs> All right, so we got that cleared up. Thank you very much, both of you. Um, so I am awaiting a motion for the public portion. Does the public portion be opened? Second. All right, I have a motion by Council President Costco and seconded by Councilwoman Spent. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? That motion carries. Uh, if anyone wishes, from anyone from the public wishes to address this proposed ordinance, you can please do so at this time. Hearing none, I move the public portion be closed. The ordinance adopted as written. Second. I have a motion by Council President Cosbo and seconded by Council President. Karen, roll call, please. Mr. Cosbo. Yes. Mr. Del Sandro. Four. Mr. Fiola. Four. Mr. Halter. Four. Ms. Miller. Four. Mrs. Spence. Four. Motion carries. Mayor, we have ordinance number 20-16, an ordinance repealing chapter 143, air pollution, section four, open, burning, prohibited, non-applicability of the code of the borough of Glassboro. Council moves for the public portion. Move the public portion be open. Second. I have a motion by Council McViola, seconded by Councilwoman Spence. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Motion carries. If anyone from the public wishes to address this proposed ordinance, you may do so at this time. I have your fork in that. Hearing none, move the public portion be closed and the ordinance adopted as written. Second. Second. I have, I have a motion by council. Uh, Councilman Fiola, seconded by Councilwoman Spence. Uh, Karen, roll call, please. Mr. Costabone. Yes. Mr. Delisandro. Four. Mr. Fiola. Four. Mr. Halter. Four. Ms. Miller. Four. Mrs. Spence. Four. Motion carries. At this time, I will entertain a motion to adopt the uh, uh, reading, the approval of the reading of the minutes of regular meeting of May 26, 2020. So moved. Second. I have a motion by Councilman D'Alessandro, seconded by Councilwoman Spence. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Motion carries. Uh, we have no communications. Uh, we move to committee reports. I'll start with Council President Cosabone. I have nothing at this time, Mayor. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Councilman D'Alessandro? Uh, Mayor, I have nothing at this time. Uh, thank you very much. Councilman Fiola? Nothing at this time, Mayor. Thank you, sir. Uh, Councilman Halter? Yeah, Mr. Mayor, I have nothing for regular business, but just as a notation, I was abstention on the uh, reading of the minutes. My video feed paused. Thank you, Karen. Did you get that noted? Yes, Mayor, I did. All right. Thank you. And thank you, Councilman. Uh, Councilwoman Miller. Uh, good evening, Mayor. Uh, the parks are open to the public with the exception of the playground equipment and the uh, basketball courts and the ball fields. And also the new date for the Park and Recreation Golf Tournament will be September the 18th. And that's all I have at this time. Thank you very much, Councilwoman. Uh, Councilwoman Spence. I have nothing tonight, Mayor. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, we have no unfinished business. Uh, Karen, do we have any new business? Yes, Mayor. We, the police department is looking for approval for to hire a SLEO 3, which I believe is a special law enforcement officer um, who uh, is a uh, part of the schools. You need so, a motion, Karen? Yes, sir, I do. I'll make that motion. Second. 
Okay, I have a motion by uh, Council President Casabone, seconded by Councilman Fiola. All those in favor, state aye. Uh, aye. aye. Opposed? Abstentions? That motion carries. Uh, engineer's report, please, Mark. Yes, good evening. Uh, the uh, landscaping work is all done in Camelot. That's wrapped up. We're waiting to hear a word from them as to when they're scheduling to have the paving completed. Uh, so that should be nearing completion. Upper Street Apartments, behind the municipal building, they started up their site work uh, this week. So they're going from concrete curb. So that work will be done, and uh, both uh, roadways will be resurfaced prior to them opening. Uh, so those Redmond Avenue uh, drainage project is continuing. They're looking to continue through this Friday as far as putting in the storm pipe. Monday, they're scheduled to put a large structure in to join the old system with the new system. Uh, right at the intersection of Redmond and the Rome Boulevard. Uh, get that, that'll take a couple of days due to the size of it. Uh, but prior to the fourth, they should be pretty much wrapped up with the drainage, uh, minus uh, doing the final paving restoration. Hollybush Drive, phase one, bids came in. Uh, we have reviewed them. Uh, we, we recommended a low bidder, and I believe that'll be on uh, your work at that time. And the last item is College Town Shopping Center. Uh, they are continuing the work. They're most of the emphasis on the site work is in the very north corner. Uh, before there, they're trying to, they did some drainage work and that stuff and they have to get the soil materials compacted so they can get paving on it. And uh, as the residents on Van Buren noticed uh, on Saturday, uh, they did have some runoff problems coming down through. Soil erosion has been notified. They have been working with them on this site for the last four months uh, due to the amount of runoff of sheet flow coming across from their system on that so they're working with that and they are also putting in additional underground storage as part of the zoning board approval out front where the new, new pad sites so that that will help make a little bit of a difference but won't net do the overall but the contractor is out there restoring the soil erosion measures to help uh, protect against the next storm and that's all i have at this time thank you anyone have any questions for mark <clears throat> thank you mark no, thank you very much, Mark. Uh, at this time, I'll turn the meeting again over to our borough solicitor. Thank, thank you, Mayor. Under our consent agenda this evening, we have resolution 147, authorizing fleet management services for the borough of Glassboro Police Department to Enterprise Fleet Management, Inc. under a national cooperative purchasing program to source well. Resolution 148, providing for the insertion of a special item of revenue in the budget pursuant to NJSA 48-4-87 Clean Communities Grant in the amount of $33,347.86. Resolution 149, also providing for the insertion of a special item of revenue in the budget pursuant to NJSA 48-4-87 Municipal Court Alcohol Education Rehabilitation an enforcement fund in the amount of $9,335.63. Resolution 150, authorizing refund of duplicate tax payment, Block 351, Lot 1.02, in the amount of $2,342.34. Resolution 151 of the Borough of Glassboro, authorizing an extension of time to negotiate and execute a redevelopment agreement, Nunk Pro Tunk, with new standard senior living. Block 427, lots 18.04 and 29. Resolution 157, authorizing execution of the second amendment to the redevelopment agreement by and between the Borough of Glassboro and the Glassboro Real Estate Trust, LLC, dated March 31st, 2017, County Spur, also known as Dr. Leo J. McCabe Boulevard. Again, for this resolution, both council persons El Sandro Spence will need to abstain. Resolution 153, resolution appointing Drew Stamen as GIF safety coordinator for the Borough of Glassboro, Nunk Pro Tunk, effective June 15, 2020. And finally, resolution 154, implementing a policy for the workforce of the Borough of Glassboro to establish core values and mutual cooperation in the ongoing COVID 19 response. This is to establish cooperation between the borough and its employees as we move forward in the borough of Glassboro. There are resolutions this evening on our consent agenda, resolution 147 to 154 if council so moves for approval. Roll call vote. 
Move oh, makes motion for approval. Second. Uh, I heard one motion. Did I get it? I heard a motion from Councilman Fiola. Do I have a second? I'll second it. I have a second by Council President Casabone. Uh, Karen, roll call, please. Mr. Casabone. Yes. Mr. D'Alessandro. Uh, four with an abstention on 152.20. Mr. Fiola. Four. Mr. Halter. Four. Ms. Miller. Four. Mrs. Spence. Four with an abstention on 152.20. Thank you very much. Uh, that, that motion passes. Um, at this time, uh, the borough administrator, you have any comments or anything to say, Ed? Nothing, Mayor. Okay, thank you very much. I'll hold my brief comments until the end. At this time, I'll entertain a motion to open the public portion. So moved. Second. Okay, I have a motion by Council President Casabone, seconded by Councilwoman Miller. All those in favor, state aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? That motion carries. Uh, the public portion is open. If anyone uh, from the public wishes to address Mayor and Council, you may do so at this time. Hello, Mayor. Hello, Council. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. This is, my name is Abiola Miles. Um, I reside at 843 Fordham Place in Glassboro. And the reason I wanted to join the call today, I just have a question about the agenda. Um, I noticed that there's a section for communication. Um, just for my edification, can you um, help me understand what type of, um, I guess, a, topics or notices or letters um, would qualify to be reported on the agenda as communications for the council to discuss? Ed or Karen, would you like to address that question as far as what, what falls under the uh, communication section of the uh, agenda? Sure, Karen, you want to take it? Sure, I can do that. Um, so under the communication section of the agenda, we typically um, put things like uh, if someone were to retire, we would put that on the agenda so that we can acknowledge that person. If someone were to resign from a position, we might put that under communication, um, things of that nature. We typically reserve um, communication for, for those type of, of notices. Thank you. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you for your question. Anyone else from the public wishes to address mayor and council may do so at this time. No. I hear a bunch of gargle. Is somebody trying to say something or? I don't uh, believe so. I think I it's tough, though, but it seems that we just have one line open that does have a lot of background noise. Okay, well, then if nobody, as if there's n no other person, I, I move the public portion be closed. Second. Okay, I have a motion by Council President Costabone, seconded by Councilwoman Spence. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? No. Abstention. And motion carries. The public portion is now closed. Uh, at this time, I'll entertain a motion to approve all duly authorized bills. Move that all duly authorized bills be paid. Second. I have a motion by Council Councilman Fiola, seconded by Councilwoman Miller. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Yes, Mayor, I have two abstentions. I'd like to abstain on PO number 20 0154 nine 
and PO number 20-0155. Thank you. Okay, those abstentions are noted. Any others? Okay, that motion carries. Um, before I ask for adjournment, I would just like to say again, as we move closer and closer to some sort of normalcy here in Glassboro, um, again, I'd like to commend all the staff and all the residents for their compliance and hard work that they've done to keep our borough uh, residents and staff as safe as possible. I just like to remind everybody that as we do start opening things up, to please continue to be mindful of the, of the things such as wearing masks um, when in close proximity and continue to wash your hands and try to maintain it as best you can social distancing and will continue to keep us all safe. Um, thank you. And with that, I'll entertain a motion for adjournment. Motion to adjourn. Second. I have a, a motion by Council President Cosbone, seconded by Councilwoman Spence. All those in favor, state aye. 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 Opposed? Attention. That motion carries. This meeting is now adjourned. Uh, have a great evening, everyone. Please be safe. The next regular meeting is scheduled for July 28th, 2020 at 7 p.m. Thank you all. Have a good Everybody night. Everybody be safe. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night.